Good morning. I'm at the house with my drone and this backpack, I have to say, is pretty freaking amazing. I got it from Target and I wasn't having high hopes for it. I just thought it would be a cute little beach backpack and it's turned out to be a Mary Poppins bag. I got my computer, the drone charger, all my ballet stuff, lunch, three water bottles, ton of stuff in this backpack. Um, so, I'll see you in ballet. Oh. I just realized I left my headphones at home. Hmm. I hadn't washed my hair since like a week. Yeah. I had to wash it like five times. Really? <laughs> because it was so full of salt and sand. Oh, that's so funny. Um, we just watched the first Stingray vlog and it's just crazy. You two are like totally different people. You have lost a ton of weight and your face has changed and your body has changed. And Jess looks like she's matured like into a whole other person and your face has changed oh and your body's changed. It's crazy. upgrades that aren't that are just happening totally it's really crazy it's really crazy and the vlogs I love you huh <laughs> so Jess made me cut that bit out if you're wondering what it is you can ask her in the comments <laughs> that's like just the same <laughs>
like took a long time to get out of the house about and since I've been on my beach body kick, 11, like 11 a.m. is the latest that I've worked out and I like really felt myself being cranky and so I was on the bus on my way to ballet and on my phone a New York Times notification popped up that they have an app called New York Times VR aka virtual reality and their thing was seeking Pluto's heart and I was like what is this and it says set foot on an alien world three billion miles away from the warmth of the sun and I just kind of had this experience of like whenever you feel like cranky or like I was really I was also upset because I didn't know what to wear like I just felt these very insignificant things feel very significant and disrupt my mood I was like whenever you feel that way like you're just a dot like go to Pluto like go explore beyond just you and so that just felt like a really cool clue and then halfway through the bar at LA I was feeling much better and it just feels in general very special today that Laura Jess and I are all hanging out and on the full moon and UHP launched yeah and full moon in Sagittarius it's the first time the three of us have ever hung out on a weekend day yeah. not in Grand Cayman or Hawaii not in Grand Cayman or Hawaii <laughs> So I am so happy we're all hanging out today, feeling the love and connection and vibrancy of Union Square. Let's go shop. Also, one more update. Last night I did a little cleanse of my closet, got rid of a bunch of stuff that's too big, and tried on a bunch of my like tight skinny jeans that are been pushed in the back of my closet. They're now at the forefront of my closet. And this jacket, when I bought it, it didn't zipper, and now it's zippered with a scarf under it. The last thing that was vlogged was us leaving Forever 21. I came home and couldn't really film anything on the way because my hands were so full carrying the drone and my camera and all my ballet stuff on my computer and everything. And then I got home 
I've eaten a bunch of crackers and now, oh, and edited the vlog. I'm so sorry. The vlogs are really late right now. I'm gonna get caught up. That one with um, on our last day when we go with something with the stingrays is like 20 minutes and I just didn't want to cut anything out. It was just, oh, it was just sweet. And so it just has taken me forever to edit. So apologies and I hope you love it. And also just everyone saying that they love all the drone footage and are sad to come to the end of the drone footage on the beach. So I wanted to include a bunch of it for you so that it's always there. So all that being said, it's now kind of late. It's like, oh, we passed my bedtime. It's 11, 11. So I'm going to go to bed and I hope you had a lovely day and I would love to hear about it. Chat with me in the comments and I'll see you guys tomorrow. And hopefully we'll be back on schedule soon. Love ya.